Chapter 16 Means of Transport and Communication Children, how did you come to school today? Hmm, so we use so many means of transport while coming to school. Some of who are staying nearby walk and come and others who stay far away come either by bus or cars. All of us move from one place to another. These means of transport are also used to carry goods from one place to another. Come, now let us share our knowledge about the different means of transport that we use. The first one is land transport. In the villages, bullock carts and horse carts carry people and their luggage from one place to another. In the desert regions, camels carry people and their luggage from one place to another. In the cities, we find many means of transport. People use cycles, motorcycles, cars, buses and auto rickshaws for transport. To carry goods, people use handcarts, tempos, and trucks. To travel long distances, we use buses or trains. The train runs at a great speed and can carry a lot of people. The train runs on a railway track. Heavy loads are transported in goods trains. Second, the water transport. To travel by sea, we use ships. A ship can carry a lot of people. Third, air transport. To travel very long distances or to reach certain places faster, we go by airplanes. The airplane is the fastest means of transport. Now, let us learn about the different means of communication. The first one, radio. The radio broadcasts the latest local, national and international news. Second, the television. We can watch news and views from all over the world on TV. Third, the newspaper. The newspapers print the latest news. We can read about all the important events around us in the newspapers. They also carry advertisements. The fourth one, letters. We write letters to our relatives and friends who are staying far away. We receive their replies by posts. The fifth one, telephone. We can talk to people who are away from us by using telephones and cell phones. This helps us to pass on and receive urgent messages. We can make local and long distance calls over the telephone or cell phones. Remember, the different means of transport enables us to travel and carry goods from one place to another easily. There are various means through which we can receive and send information. Now, let us do some activities. The first one, put a tick mark against the animal that people ride. Elephant, yes. Dog, no. Camel, yes. Horse, yes. Donkey, 
No. Cat. No. Two. Match the following. Urgent news. Telegram. To watch and hear. Television. Printed information. Newspaper. Welfare news. Letters. To talk to a person at a distance. Telephone. Put a tick mark against the vehicle in which you have already travelled. Horse cart. Bus. Rickshaw. Train. Scooter. Bullock cart. Airplane. Boat. Cycle. Fourth. Identify each picture given below and fill in the blanks with suitable words from the brackets. Newspaper Radio Post box Telephone Television Letters Fifth, put the following means of transport from the brackets in their proper group. Train, airplane, boat, helicopter, car, spacecraft, yacht, cycle, ship. By land, train, cycle, car, by water, boat, yacht, ship, by air, airplane, helicopter, spacecraft.